Over the next series of sessions, we're going to look at light, in particular, how light can affect the composition of your image and how you can use light to create really interesting effects and really interesting depth within your images. Let's dive in and let's use light within our photography practice. When you're working with light in your photography, it's really about getting the kind of effect that you want and using the light to utilize this. So in this picture of me, we have a really dramatic image. I'm just gonna explain the lighting for this so you can understand it and maybe use it within your photography. So first of all, we have our light, which is coming from our right side as we're looking at the image, but from our left side, um, if we're, we're going to be the person that is in the image, so myself in this occasion. So let me just create the center line so you can see right down the middle here that I've sectioned my image in half. So I've used myself as the center frame and I've created the light split in the middle. So everything on this side of the line is a shadow, so it's in darkness and everything on this side of the line is the light. So you can clearly see where the light is coming from because of where shadow falls. And that's a really good way to tell where light's coming from. Obviously, as you can see, light's coming from this side because that's where light is on my face. And on the other side, you'll notice it's all in shadow. Now, everything that we're gonna work on in this course is taken off my smartphone. So I use an iPhone, but there's no difference whether you use an iPhone or a Samsung or a Galaxy, for example. So I'm just highlighting here the light spots within our image. So I've done very little editing to this, so this is really direct out the camera. When we get into the editing part, I'll show you how to tone down those highlights, etc. So if you want a dramatic scene or dramatic lighting, side lighting is a fantastic option to do that. In order to achieve this effect, all I've done is I've placed the light off to the side, so off my camera, pointing at the subject, which in this case, is me. Try this for yourself guys, have a go, experiment. Your light source can be anything, so it could be a window, so it could be natural light, or it could be a light that you put up on a light stand. It could even be a lamp in your home. There's really no reason that you can't try this with any sort of device that gives you light. It could even be a second smartphone with the torch on. Okay, have fun and I'll see you in the next session.